He was just 20 years old and working on the family farm in Iowa when the Japanese attacked Pearl Harbor. The strapping young man finished milking the cows, got in his car and drove 40 miles to enlist in the army. His name was Blois Bruns and though he would become a staff sergeant, he was simply known as the Big Swede to the men in his outfit. He was with the 5th Army when it landed south of Salerno, Italy and fought with distinction at both Anzio and Monte Cassino, two of the most difficult campaigns of the war. It's in the mountains near Civitavecchia where he noticed one of his scouts wounded by sniper fire. It was his tentmate, and he's slowly bleeding to death. With German crossfire piercing the air, the big Swede disobeys a direct order and crawls 300 yards to his friend, puts him on his back, and slowly crawls back to safety. His buddy would survive the war, but sadly the big Swede would be killed by mortar fire a week later. Blois Bruns is buried with his parents in Galva, Iowa,